Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? Um, so today we're both here, so that's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, it's really hard to get in the same time. I know. It's Spirit Week. I'm wearing gold. I'm wearing gold too, but I'm wearing my hoodie, I guess. So, well, it's not gold. It's like yellow. It's a pretty sweet shirt, though, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we have some things that we suppose we should talk about. Probably. Um, one of the things that I want to talk about first. Um, there was this thing on the internet. It was on theinsider.com. And it was like 28 reasons why the Twilight book might be better than the movie. Oh my and God. those reasons were all stupid. We've got it here. We're going to look at it and tell you. We won't read you every reason, but basically through all of this. Like it would give you a reason. And the reason that they liked it was like it was already in the book. You should go check it out. It's at theinsidernews.com. We'll put a and link to it. Type in 28 reasons why Twilight, the movie, may be better than the book. It was just, it's just stupid. Yeah. There's a lot of stuff in here. Um, yeah, I just don't even get it. It's stupid. You can yeah. go look for yourself. But it, it, read it because it might be entertaining to sit there and yell at it. Yeah. It made me mad. It'll do some steam. Okay. okay. Um, there's also... They're coming up with different taglines for the movie, for New Moon. You say your favorite Okay, first. this is my favorite one. It'll be as though I never existed. Because it's actually, like, in the book. <laughs> my favorite one is forbidden to remember, terrified to forget. Then there's a couple other ones it that I wrote down. It makes you think. And some other um, ones are love bites back. Somewhere a clock is ticking. Yeah, and... Yeah, that's those are just like four of them. I mean, there's some other ones, but I didn't go into much depth to go find it. So, um, oh, this is something that I really was excited about because I'm gonna get one. They have um, Bella's bracelets, and they're selling them at Marco Polo. I don't really know what that it's is. It's a startup company. Yeah, I do know that because I read the news story. Dude, so did I, but I didn't write it down. Yeah. Okay, anyway, they're fourteen dollars ninety nine cents with you know the. Diamond Heart and the Wolf. Well, it's not really diamond if you're buying it for fourteen dollars and ninety nine cents. You know what I mean? It shines like a rainbow. Okay. Probably not. Okay. This is, makes me mad. This next news. Okay, New Moon. You do the, this one, and I'll do this one. Okay, because I'll just start yelling if I tell yeah. about that. Okay, they haven't. Um, for New Moon, they haven't thought of who's going to be cast for Jane and Aro yet. Like, they haven't decided who they want to cast yet for that, and I'm kind of excited to see who they do. Because, like, in my mind, I don't have, like, a set stone picture of what I think they look like. They're just <laughs> shadows in the wind. I was listening to Imprint. It's a podcast you guys should all listen to. Twilight Source runs it. And they were like, why don't we just... Ca-? They didn't say this about uh, Jane but or Arrow. Um, but... Why don't we just cast Dakota Fanning if we're going to cast Vanessa Hudgens? <laughs> oh, yeah, we haven't gotten to that part yet. They're not casting Vanessa Hudgens as Leah Clearwater. But, bringing up Leah Clearwater, because she's not in the script. In um, New Moon. She's not going to be in New Moon now, at all. This is speculation, I guess. I don't know if it's confirmed that she's not in the script. But... Not that important anyways. She's really ticked, but I'm just like, yeah. yeah but you know what would tick me off even more? If they put dumb Disney stars in the Twilight movie. You want to know why? Because they've not... I, I don't like those dumb Disney stars. Any of them. You tell them. Okay? And it's going to make Twilight into a completely different genre of movie. It's going to become like one of those stupid Disney movies, like High School Musical, that everyone's always singing and talking about. And guess what? It's not for high schoolers. It's for little kids. We need to do a disclaimer real quick. She's crabby today. <laughs> I am crabby. And whoever, because I know that you're going to watch this movie, this person that I'm crabby at. And yeah, thanks for making my day a really crabby day. So in conclusion, no. the book is way better than the movie. I think that my tagline is the best, and he thinks his tagline is the best. Yeah, because my tagline makes you think. Like, it will be as though, oh no, that's yours. Forbidden to remember, terrified to forget. You're like, what does that mean? And then you're like, oh. See, but I think it'll be as though I never existed because it's actually a line from the book. It's one of my favorite lines from the book, even though that was the worst line in the book ever. She cried. 
No joke. Kelly Clarkson has been reading Twilight. Did you know that? I did. I read that. She said, I'm on Breaking Dawn. It's actually interrupting my sleeping pattern. I'm crazy. Every girl is, like, obsessed. I went to Cancun, Mexico for New Year's with a bunch of friends. We were laughing because as we were lying out sunbathing, sunbathing, literally every female at the pool had one of those books in the Twilight series. I've had one of those books from the Twilight series. Yeah, so that means that. I saw a girl buying Twilight at Walmart this weekend. Doesn't it make you happy? Well, she was like, oh, I'm just so excited to be reading New Moon. I just read Twilight, and it was so good, and I want to read New Moon. And I was like, you are in for a rude awakening. <laughs> I didn't say anything, but I whispered to my friend, who I wasn't mad at at the time. And I, But now she is. But now I am. I'm mad at, like, two people. Because that, what that friend did was really shady. Comment. Great. Subscribe. Peace.